never ever say it was like a bullet out of a gun. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> so you'll be wanting innocent? Yeah. Have we got any mates? Yeah, one or two, yeah. We'll give them more regards. How you going, girl? <laughs> Lenny. They've been clean for years. The most awesome man in Britain. 20,000 street fights, broken uh, limbs, well, yeah. shot. Yeah. What made you decide to become an actor? He started hurting me, Gary. You know, no, seriously, girl. I've been minding the roughest, toughest clubs in town, Brixton, East London, North London. I've been shot twice, stabbed. I must have had 20,000 bar and brawls. I broke my hands 15 times, got pins in my hands. And I think what actually turned me, I was, when I was nicked for that murder that I'd never done, and it was proven at the old Bailey, I used to lay in the cell and I speak to myself, I'm in here, I'm looking at a life sentence for nothing. So I thought to myself, you know, uh, if I ever get out of this, I promise myself I'll get out of it, I'm going to go a different road. And when you see them prats on the telly, all acting tough guys, it was silly as a box of lights. I've always thought I'm always getting the acting game and I'm the real thing. And uh, yeah, I've just done a Bruce Willis film. Well, it'll be a lovely man. Absolute gentleman down to earth, told me jokes. And, uh, you know, good guy. When are we going to see that then? I won't be out till next year. And uh, I, got, I got myself uh, five episodes on the knock, which I like to think for all night. He was a lovely man because when I went up for the casting, the casting director went, because you always hear behind the scenes afterwards, the cars and directors said, we don't want him, he's a proper tough guy. We want an actor. So Paul and I said, no, this guy, you know, we were told to give him a chance. He's uh, got an agent, he's got his equity card, give him a chance. And I'd just like to thank him, lovely man. We've just seen, last Sunday, the episode went out, where you were overpowered by some of these customs officers, and I thought, that must be the best bit of acting you've ever done in your life, because for you to be... Well, yeah, it was a hard bit of acting, because it's the first time I've ever been on the floor. And, uh, no, what happened? Let me tell you what happened. When we'd done the scene, I couldn't go over. I was like, over, and, and, and they're stumping me, and then Caston got an old sound of me, and then go over, and then go over, and I went, no. And they went, cut. The director, I said, Lenny, you've got to go over. I went, all right then. I said, how do you do it? He said, put your legs in your knees, and you'll fall. I went, all right. I said, I'll do that. So I went over, and uh, they all said, oh, thanks for going over. Then we couldn't get you over. I said, no, I said, no. It's a film, so I don't mind going over. But it couldn't happen in real life, and that would love. That was a lovely love. Now, people, your real life is like a movie script. It reads like one, doesn't it? Yeah. And, and your biography's coming out very soon. Yeah, uh, my biography was done by a guy named Peter Gerard, a fantastic writer. And, uh, yeah, the biography's coming out probably in a couple of months. But what they're trying to do is they're trying to bring it out at the same time as the movie. Because we've actually got finance now after 11 years. You know when people say that? This is the film of your life, isn't it? The Governor? Well, it was called The Governor, but because it don't relate in America, they've changed it to total respect. Because you've got to understand in America, the Governor, if you go up for presidency, wherever it means the toughest guy in town. Yeah. So, uh... Who are they ever going to get who will be convincing playing you? Oh, I don't know. Uh, they're looking at a couple of possibles. What about Tom Cruise? No, well, no, well, no, 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 I'm not really joking, uh, I don't really know, I mean, I'll leave it up to them, all I am on this, uh, on this is, is the advisor on the set, but uh, as long as they find a good actor, uh, but remember, uh, this film, you don't need a star, because the, the, the film will make the actor a star, it's like another Rocky film, but, but bare knuckles, and, uh, and it's a true story, so uh, I think it's going to do well. What advice would you give the bloke who plays you, what would you... Oh, no, I talk to him when I just say, be tough, be good, be fair, and be fast. <laughs> well, that was fast. <laughs> <Get hold. laughs> I wasn't even expecting that. This guy is okay.